my dear students, we're still in unit number four, and now we will going to learn about our grammar grammar part in unit four. And the first lesson in the grammar part is subject verb agreement. What what do we mean by this? Let's see together. First, we have something that we call singular noun and verb agreement. The singular means that it's only just one thing, one thing, one and single alone, okay? One person, one object, one place, one animal, it's only one thing, okay? Like what? Like car, it's one car, so it's singular. One tree, one bull, this is the singular means okay and let's remember together what are the nouns or the nouns is like the nouns are like persons animals places and things okay we have something here we have to know it very much it's very important any singular noun plus singular verb we have to add S to the verb. Again, in singular noun plus singular verb, we have to add S in the verb. Like what? Like a bird sings. A bird sings. A bird here is a singular noun because it's only one bird. So, what the bird is doing? The bird sings. Let's see another example. Okay, again, singular noun plus singular verb, add S to the verb. One more time, singular noun plus singular verb, add the S to the verb. Here, a flower grows. A flower, only one flower, it's singular noun, grows. So, it's singular verb. So, how did we know that it's singular verb? Because it's only one flower and we added S to the verb. Let's see more examples. Singular noun plus singular verb, add the S to the verb. Okay? The apple falls. The apple falls. It's only one apple, so we added S to the verb. So the apple falls. And here, singular noun plus singular verb, add the S to the verb. A boy, it's only one boy, it's singular noun, dances. Dances. We added S to dance to be a singular verb. Okay, so a singular noun is one person or one place or one thing or one animal. It's only one, okay? And a singular noun has S at the end of its verbs. Okay, like we said before. Like here in this example, the puppy plays. It's only one puppy, so plays. The puppy plays. And let's remember together what are the nouns. The nouns are the names of persons, animals, places and things. Thank you very much and see you soon.